1976, then President Milton Oboti officiated the opening of the country's top most luxurious Apollo Hotel, which remained a landmark for decades to pass. One of the tallest buildings in Kampala. Uh, of course, it was called Apollo. I think Apollo had something to do with the somebody who had a name like that. <laughs> Because uh, the, the husband of Miriam, who is sitting here, he was called Apollo Milton Obote. So I think he didn't want to say Obote, so he said Apollo. So. <laughs> now it was a very good hotel. Uh, we would come there, very good rooms, very, very modern, really. Fifty years later on, a Jovio President Yoweri Museveni has expressed his deep appreciation on the Golden Jubilee celebrations for now Sheraton Kampala Hotel, which has since been privatized by government. Because some of our managers were coming from Raikutura, <laughs> looking after cows, some have been looking after goats somewhere. So I said, no, let's get people who have got a tradition of looking after hotels. The president says that stability and growth of the economy should continue to allow local and foreign directed investments with the space to generate profit. From seven acres of land, you are earning $12 million a month. That's $140 million a year. If you are to grow sweet potatoes there, <laughs> I don't know how much you will be earning from the seven acres. Reina Ojo, NTV.